Let me tell you about my Good Friday experience. I was eating Thanksgiving dinner and reading the paper of the sales that were going to be the next day. Then I noticed that the best sale was at Target on this particular electronic device that I wanted to buy. And they opened at 9. Well, I thought if I get there at 9, I'm going to be in a long line. I don't like long lines. So I'll wait until after midnight, being smart. So I drove to Target, and I saw the barriers outside that the people had been standing in that snaked around like a long maze. And I walked up to the front door, and I thought, man, I am smart to avoid this. Now, inside Target, it was just packed solid. I walked to the back to the electronics department and I asked if they still had this item. The woman said, yes, they have some. And there was a cage behind the cashiers and they still had some. I counted about 10. And she said, but you're going to have to stand in line. I said, well, I mean, where am I going to go? I've got plenty of time. I'll stand in line. And I started to walk to what I perceived to be the back of the line in the electronics department. And she laughed, a knowing laugh, and she said, no, that's where the line turns. It begins down there, down there in the men's department. Well, I look, and I had my contacts in, so I couldn't see that well, but I I looked to what I perceived to be about a mile away to the other side of the store to the men's department, I thought, surely the line couldn't start there. I think she saw the blood drain from my face (laughs) as I walked away, and I walked clear down to the end of the store. Well, the line wrapped around the men's department, and it continued all the way. Well, I was there at 12.15, and I decided that life's too short, uh, that I didn't want to spend my entire night in that line. There was only one other time in my life that I saw a line like this, and that was at Walt Disney World. But the thing about Walt Disney World is, if you stand in the line at the end of the line, you know you're going to have what you desire to have. You're going to ride on the ride. I was sure that they would be out of the item that I wanted by the time I got up there to the cashier. So I left. And I prayed that I would find the item, and everything worked out just fine. I might have spent a little bit more money, but not a lot. You know, time is valuable, and uh, it is something to realize that when you spend time with God... Everything works out. You don't have to go through continuously the school of hard knocks and be hit over the head with a two-by-four to to learn lessons. There is an easier way all the time in life. And that's what I found that night. But I thought it was humorous. I still laugh at it every time I think about it. Uh, The woman laughing, that knowing laugh, and seeing the blood drain out of my face when I actually realized how long the line was. And I, 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 I just pray that you had a good Thanksgiving weekend and that you enjoyed the sales. I pray with you today that God blesses you and your family continuously. And the lines of life that you will stand in, I pray that they turn out at the end to have your desired destination. God bless you.